hello everyone today i'm going to show you how i prepare this vegetable okba we call it special okba wawa or okba nine smile it contains a lot of delicious ingredients like onions and so on so guys if you're interested let's go to my kitchen and let me show you how i prepare these special delicacies hello welcome to cook with ijama where we have a very good nice recipe so stay tuned and let's get started so i have the ingredients that i'm going to use to make this special but i have green grated grapefruit onions and habanero pepper i have salt and red oil so first i'm going to start adding the oba into the bowl and after adding it I'm going to add some red oil in it before mixing so it depends on how many cups of water you are cooking okay so I added some red oil I love adding red oil in my oil so well so I mix the red oil with the powdered oil then after that I'm going to start adding hot water I've already boiled the water waiting for the oba but make sure that when you're making this oba your water is very hot okay after the, after boiling it just bring it down and just wait about two minutes before adding it I'm not going to use my hand because of the water is very hot so after turning it to the way I want it I'm going to start using my hand to mix it because my hand is going to do the perfect work that we need in this oba you can use your wooden um spoon or spatula but hand is better for me because i'm doing it our traditional way of doing this oba so if you want to get oba just try to do it in a traditional way so after the wooden spoon i'm going to use my hand to make this oba so you can see how i'm making the oba with my hand the way i'm mixing it and making it to be slimy okay when you are doing your oba to know that your oba is going to be good make sure that your oba is slimy when you are using your hand or you are using your spatula or wooden spoon to mix it so if you watch how I do the oba and watch how the oba is before you start adding another water. Don't just mix it with spoon like you're mixing more and, more and start cooking it, okay? Just use your hand, press the oba very well with the pot or bowl, any one that you're using. You're going to get a good result. Look at how slimy the oba is. So now I use the wooden spoon again because I wanted to add some hot water. So I'll use the wooden spoon to turn it now until we get to the last result. So when you're adding your water, try to add it little by little. Don't just pour the water direct, everything into it. Add little by little or bit by bit until you get to the last result so i'm going to show you how your body is going to look like after we added the water for home delivery cooking number one all african dishes now would be number one mm -hmm. number one Cook with the German number one. Naja Jalob, number one. Now we be number one. Eh, okay. Number one. Cook with the German number one. On IG, cook with the German. Facebook, cook with each other. YouTube, cook with each other. Just cook with each other.
for you to stop adding water into the up bar use your wooden stick and check the back of it if you notice that you can see the back of this stick a little bit stop adding water you can use your finger and put inside the up bar if you notice that when you put your hand and remove it and you can see the back of your finger a little bit stop adding water then you will know that your hot bar is ready to start tying it up and put inside the pot so now this is the pot i'm going to use i added some foil into it so that the hot bar will not stick at the bottom of the pot and then some water just add enough water into your pot then after adding the water i'm going to put it on the burner and allow it to boil so i have uh, nylon i'm going to use and some thread because i told you that i'm going to do it the natural way we are doing the upper in my state which is in state okay so after that we're going to make the upper special which is adding the onions crayfish okay the pepper the salt and the vegetable which is green so i'm going to add all these ingredients together into this oba and mix it please don't add it when you're mixing the oba add all add all the vegetable all the ingredients when you have already mixed the oba then you are okay to put it so you can see the way i did follow the instruction and you're going to get the real oba in good state because if you did not follow the instruction you will end up making the upper to look like moi moi it will not be up by anymore so the upper have rules so follow the rules and cook it so after adding the vegetable i'm going to mix everything together and start tying it so i have my nylon opened i just put it in a cup and start adding the oba into it then after adding the oba into the nylon i'm going to use the thread to tie it up so in my land in my land we call it santana so if you're going to buy the nylon ask them about the santana the one that is very strong but here in diaspora i bought this one from audi so i'm going to use this trade i got it from my rice bag and i kept it because i'm going to use it to cook this up <laughs> so my mom used to get it enough and keep uh, kept it at home so whenever we want to cook the oba we use it so you can see how i'm tying the oba i'm tying it down i'm not tying it up i'm tying it down because it will help the oba to tie very well when you are tying this oba make sure that the thread is going down not going up you will get a very perfect oba when you cook it okay so i'm just cooking exactly the way my mom used to cook it so after that i cut off the mouth of the nylon then I'm going to tie another one then after that I'm going to put everything in a second bag because I don't trust this bag <laughs> I don't trust it the first time I did it I just put the upper into the pot guys everything just tear into pieces that was why I used to double it anytime you are tying your bar after tying it put direct to the pot inside the hot water okay and when you want to add more water into the hot bar, boil another hot water and pour inside there don't add cold water so you can cook about 45 minutes to one hour then you will know that your hot bar is ready to go so look at the hot bar, guys it's very delicious and yummy I enjoyed it so much okay so guys try it you're going to get the oba exactly the way i do it please don't forget that when you are cooking the oba make sure you tie and put directly to the hot water okay bye